Hello guys, I'm Walt Moore and this is Walt Moore's uh, Celtic Knot um, guide. Basically guide, uh, guys, this is the easiest one um, of the kind of clue scrolls and, and the compass puzzles and what not to do. This is absolutely easy, I'm going to show you now. Um, there's nothing really that you need to know about it, but basically what you do is, um, so for all of them, you got to find your own way. So you've got the blue you know you got the blue um, uh, whatever you want to call it really path, blue path, red path and grey path now pretty much all you do is you concentrate on two paths okay so we're going to concentrate on the let's say the grey here and the blue okay so the grey and the blue so they're the only two paths we're looking at at the moment so basically what you do guys is you twist um, so for this one, you can you can change and, and whatnot. So we're going to take the blue one for now. Yeah, uh, we're going to keep the grey one how it is, and move the blue one. So as you can see, we've got two unlocks there, but these two didn't unlock. So we know this isn't right. So what we can do is move the blues around, um, keep on moving around, and as you can see here yeah, on this blue, not not that I recommend doing it this way for you starting off. See, we ain't got no more of these uh, lava runes. I think they're lava runes. So we know that this one can't be correct if that one doesn't fit in there properly. So what we can do is then uh, move it around. But what we get, I was going to say, guys, is that you can just move the blues the whole way around and keep them going and see if all four um, intersections where they meet um, actually go green. That's what you want. That's what you're looking for. So we know that one ain't right. So nature. So I see a nature room there. I've got two nature rooms on my blues. So does that work? One. No. So we keep on going to the other nature room. Oh, gone a bit too far there. And again, no, that didn't work. So we now know that the nature rooms ain't working. So we go to the next one, which is soul rune, no not soul rune, mist rune or uh, not I'm so sure, anyway have we got any of them? we've got one now so we can move this around guys, so we've got another one as well is that unlocking all four? no, there's only uh, one green so let's move this again to the next, oh shit, sorry wrong one guys, so we move the blue one around again um, to the next rune that fits it and oh, it's two of them but not all four, so we know that still don't work. So you carry this on, guys. So again, going to swap it around. Ah, uh, we know we've got one of them, and only one of them. So we can go around, and no, that doesn't work. So next one, which is I think a smoke room. Um, so what do we do? Have we got any smoke rooms? Yeah, we've got one now. Um, we've got one now. So I'm going to go backwards here, guys, just to make it a little bit quicker. Does this work? No. Right, if you move it around again, does this work? No. So again, you just move it around, guys. Um, so it might be a bit long, but it's so easy to do, guys. So have we got any astrals? See, I, have, I know I haven't got any astrals on the blue. You can invert the paths or whatever if you want. Yeah, I know I ain't got no astrals on the blues. That's absolutely fine. So I can move to the next one, Cosmics. I know I've got a Cosmic here. So go around again. There you go. I don't know why I wasn't doing it there. So go around on the cosmic and no, didn't work there. So move around again, guys, and we keep on doing this until we find the right one. So I'm gonna maybe uh, fast forward this bit for you guys. As you can see here, guys, uh, I've now done it. Uh, the first path. Um, this may change again depending on what the red one does, but for now, um, we keep it like this. Now, once you've got all four of these um, intersections um, green, 
lit up um, for the grey and the blue one, don't worry about the red one. When you've done that, you then move on to the next step, which is step two. So basically, you move this one, uh, the red one around now, and hope that all of them light up green. Like so, guys. That's how you do it. It's so simple, guys. It's, it's unbelievable. So, so step one, guys. Um, move the blue one clockwise all the way around until all four bits are green. If not green, then you move the grey one around clockwise, one click, and then the blue one clockwise again. And repeat this again and again until you get all four intersections of the blue and the green lit up. Now move on to the reds and unlock the reds and then move the red clockwise until all lights up when done press unlock and happy days you got your clue right guys i hope you enjoyed the uh... Celtic knot um, guides i hope it's been helpful remember to subscribe and like and there will be a lot, a lot more new videos out guys i'm announcing